What's up everybody, it's Ryan Donnelly from RyanD.com. Today's video I'm gonna talk about a special request email on a topic they want me to speak on. And I have talked about this in the past and I have gotten a lot of emails from people asking me to upload my old videos. I have been starting to do that. Um, it takes some work to edit it and get it up and go through what I'm allowed to put up still and what I'm not. Um, there was some, some push for me to put down some of the videos and we'll just keep it at that but I am putting up old videos uh, just give me um, some time I put up about five old ones yesterday I'm going through the most popular ones the ones that were viewed the most and editing those and bringing those back up so uh, just uh, give me a little slack on that I know you guys want the old videos believe me I want all my videos back up it was a lot of work to do over 800 videos and uh, it's kind of rough to start all over again and not really start over again but have to go through each one all right so the video they want me to talk about the topic is when you know you're using for so long you obviously need it just to function okay otherwise you start getting withdrawal symptoms you start feeling sick you're unable to do anything without the, uh, the drug in your system so it completely takes over your mind and body now in most cases, people feel like they need the drug to feel normal, and this is what they wanted me to talk about. What you think is normal is not actually normal, all right? You forgot what normal is, normal function. Over time, that's normal. Everyone goes through it. I went through it. I thought I was completely normal, and nowhere near was I normal. The drug completely takes over your whole life, okay? And when you're functioning, you feel like, oh, I'm more social, I'm easier to be around, I'm better at my job, if I'm in sales, I'm, I'm much more outgoing. It's all bullshit. Because <clears throat> over time, you're using just to feel not sick, okay? But you're not as sharp as you used to be. You might think you are, but you're not. There's people that will argue this to their, on their deathbed, that they're better when they're on these, these meds. And I'm just not gonna believe it, because I've seen it firsthand, I lived it. All right, you have to give yourself some time. When you come off, you give yourself two, three weeks, a month, and you'll see how much clearer your mind is. All right, you'll you'll feel the little victories, as I call them, or little natural highs that come back. One of the main things that comes back, and a lot of people will back me on this, is music. All right, music is one of those things that human beings love because it just gets you going. Whether it's Whatever your, your taste in music is, for some reason, it'll give you goosebumps, it'll get you motivated, but when you're using, for some reason, a lot of people don't feel that way. Now, I'm still sweating a little bit, I just got back from a run. <clears throat> so, you have to give yourself some time to actually feel what normal is, and you'll feel it. Thing, and I said this in many videos, you know, lights are brighter, you know, smells you pick up on things that you you know you were numb for so long you didn't realize that you were missing out on all these natural beautiful things about life all right your relationships will get better especially sexually okay because when you're using you have no sexual desire some people do but the majority of people you know sex takes a back door because you're fulfilled by these these drugs and when you come off the drugs you can be a one minute man or you could be, you know, struggling in that area. And believe me, it'll all come back to normal. You just gotta practice, okay? And your partner, you let them know right away that, hey, things aren't gonna be normal for a while. I need to get my stamina back up. So all these things, your body's going through these, these changes. You have to allow it to happen and you'll be so excited to feel again, all right? Some people even enjoy feeling pain because they haven't felt pain in a long time. Now, I'm not talking about withdrawal pain. I'm talking about like actual pain from like, you know, skidding your knee or, you know, bumping your elbow, your funny bone. A lot of these things wouldn't really produce the actual pain that you had because you were so damn numb that, I mean, you could hit, get hit with a bat and you wouldn't feel it, okay? So allow all this stuff to happen. You'll enjoy it. I'm still sweating like crazy. And um, the feeling of normal will come back and you'll be like, holy crap. This is what normal is, okay? You actually feel, all right? All of it, your soul comes back. And it's, it's a really beautiful thing for people to actually experience and they, they welcome it with open arms. And they look back on the time they were using and be like, damn, I wasn't even close to normal. 
all right? What I thought was normal was just me not getting sick. And that's no way to live, all right? There's freedom and you could reach it. You just gotta push yourself to get there. And believe me, you'll, you'll be very happy you did. You'll be happy you fought that battle and took your life back, all right? That's it for today. If you guys want me to talk about certain topics, you can email me at ryandperspective.com. It's ryandperspective at gmail.com or ryan at comsupport.com. One or the other. All right. So uh, check out freefromhell.com as well. Um, And that's it. All right. I'll see you guys tomorrow and enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks.